stabbed 28 times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started in the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to the living room. sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. That chair. I'm going to check something. Uh, I'm going to check something.
I was just defending myself. He was gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! Oh, shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now! Dinner is ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. There wasn't much in the kitchen. I did what I could. my job because of androids and when I need somebody to take care of this goddamn house what do I do I go out and hire a fucking android what a joke of course androids are so fucking wonderful they never fail they never tired. They were sad. They're so fucking perfect. They ruined my fucking life. What are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. It's all your fault. Daddy, no. It's all your fucking fault. here come back here come back here right now you stay there don't you dare fucking move or I'll bust you worse than last time
He's coming. He's gonna hurt me. Run! Get away, or he's gonna break you like last time. You're coming with me. Daddy's very mad, Alice. Very mad. That was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the hell am I doing here? I hate cocktail parties and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. All they care about is how much money they're going to make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. Scotch? Neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Marcus, no, I'm gonna come with you. Leo, look who's here, my father's plastic toy. Leo, what's going on? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here. Listen, 
You should go before things get worse. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect like this fucking thing? That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes it so special Whoa. anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't? Leave him alone! <laughs> Come on! Let's see what you got! Marcus, don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one. Ugh, stop it. What's the matter, too much of a pussy? Stop mm. it, Leo! Stop it! Too scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Uh. Person, you're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. I'm no. gonna destroy you. And it'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nobody's gonna give a shit. Because you're nothing. You hear me? You're nothing. No. Carl, no. Okay, please don't go. Don't leave. Remember, Marcus. Don't let anybody tell you who you are. No. No. Dad. No. Please. This is all your fault. This never would have happened if it weren't for you. The android. Who's the android? Why'd you kill him? What happened before you took that knife? How long were you in the attic? Why didn't you even try to run away? Say something, goddammit! Fuck it, I'm out of here. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You could always try roughing it up a little. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. <laughs> <laughs> 